Hi everyone, it is the 1st of March 2023 and today I'm going to be doing this midweek mad mid midweek magic. I thought it was mid midweek madness. Oh well, midweek magic into the future. Um don't know what it is, but of course because it's midweek magic, it's a casual event so I don't need to worry about worry about losing so much as I just need to care about getting my wins in. Um, now yesterday I did a, a draft just for the sake of getting a medal here because the March season has begun and I was saying at the start of that that um, I've been speaking to Tyler about things um, and he says that I need to slow down, look at the cards because sometimes I rush things and I don't think about things in like so many turns ahead. Uh, so last time I tried commenting on. I tried go like you know probably like sitting down and I mean I'm sitting down anyway but you know what I mean like going through all of the points, all of the cards, everything that was crum coming up. <coughs> and um, the result of that was after me really trying I even skipped out on a rare in the draft pick but the result of that was that um I did just as well as I normally do um but also the audio was messed up it started glitching out after just a few minutes so that's really annoying the commentary that is and the only reason I could think of that would be because I recently got the Windows update and so I had to sort of reconfigure the settings for my headset so I don't know if that's got anything to do with it hopefully that was just a one-off I don't know why that happened I don't think it's a hardware failure I mean I have had this headset since 2015 I don't think it's a hardware failure but I mean it could be but either way uh, the same again could happen here um, and the thing is as well is that when I do my test it works fine but the thing with the test is that I only test for like a minute. I don't do a, like an hour long test. So it sort of did deteriorate. Now hopefully this one will be fine. If not, then I'm going to have to really look into what's going on there. But otherwise, uh, let's just... I'll just take it as a one-off glitch, I guess. And uh, let's get into it, midweek magic. Now, I need three wins. And I need to choose one of these decks. Um, I don't have any daily quest requirements. So for Mirrodin, we are Legion, Big Red. Um, counterpoints. I think I'll go for counterpoints. Should have probably inspected the deck. Yeah, view deck. Like I said, I'm not too. I'm not too worried about uh, getting losses. Um, I just need to get three wins, so I'm not. I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not gonna. Um, I didn't even check the lands. I mean, not that I even checked those cards, but I'm not gonna dwell on things now. This is. I mean, the purpose of this recording now is mostly to test the audio to make sure that it works perfectly fine. So this this could be a quick video, depending on how well I do. Right. Oh, we've got the full out lands. Right, so I've got the pain lands. Evolving adaptive. Hold on. If you weren't the starting player. Okay. That's interesting. I'm going to keep anyway. The 
Let's see if I you, you control two on more. Right. So one thing Tyler pointed out was that there was one time when I had a sequencing error where this thing, the evolving adaptive, I didn't uh, get it out on time. Uh, I'll bring you out. I don't need the coloured mana. Right. In your first strike, I don't want to attack. So, whenever you cast a creature spell, put a 1-1 one, one counter on Curl on Beast Caller. <clears throat> so you've manifested something there. Right. It's a nice proliferate effect. Uh, no, I don't want to attack because I want them to. If the, I don't want them to get through there too, too. That's a big thing as well. Right. Put a 1-1 one, one counter on target creature you control if that if you weren't the start to play that creature then deals combat damage equal to its power to target creature you don't control. Okay. Uh I could bring that out. But I think I'd rather get rid of that. I mean that's <laughs> Of course, I didn't read all the text of what that does. But proliferating will be nice. And they've got a lot of cards. Was that when it deals, it's dealt damage, take that many non land cards at the beginning of your next end step, discard those cards. Okay. Oh. So, yeah, they've got a couple of those. Let's just get rid of those. Uh. So I can distribute them, can I? Well, you're a 4-4. Four, four. So I, I want to get you, one on you. And three on you. So I'll be able to power that up next turn, unless they can do something now. It's strange, I mean, I know it's an alchemy card. It's strange that it doesn't, um... Exile them, and then you can pay them to end the turn because because it's alchemy, it doesn't need to. Yeah, I want. I'm taking that damage because. Um. I'm taking the damage because I want both these these to be around. Yep. I can power both those up. If I attack with everything. Yep. I mean, I'm not. Um. You know, I'm not taking the time to read all these. 
It's probably probably would be best practice. Right. Now, if I attack with everything, what's the most they can block? Right. Uh. I can attack with both of them. They'll block one of them. both of them. Never mind. Ah, see, why, why did I think? I see, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Like, how did that go over my mind? Why did I not think to myself, oh yeah, they'll block both of those. Yeah, that's not gonna help. <sighs> why, why did I? Why did I see those two creatures? Why did it not occur to me? I mean, I'm just playing like I normally would. I know, like Tyler said, like you don't take the time, but like I said, this is a midweek magic. So even something simple as that, why did, why did I not think? Oh yeah, they can block with both of them. Okay. See, the thing is, is that there's so much text on these cards. Right, what do you do? Are you the same thing? I think you are. Right. When you catch an Eskrit spell, put a 1 1 counter, trample counter, and vigilance counter on it. So this can keep attacking and proliferating. Unless, th so they're going to have to want to get rid of that, aren't they? So, oh, I'll block it, I guess. Right. Now I'll bring you out, and then I can bring you out. Uh, not in this turn, I can't, though. I'll make you green. Um Yeah, I'll leave you on top. I'll attack with both. Oh, of course I didn't see 
I mean, that's I mean that's a thing that I didn't consider that's good. Proliferate will affect that thing as well. So I'll make you blue. Uh, yeah, I'll leave that on top. And I shall probably put a 1-1 one -one counter run. Hold on. On each X target land you control, they each become 0-0 zero -zero elemental creatures with reach haste. And when this creature leaves the battlefield, conjure a card named Forest onto the battlefield tapped. They are still lands. Right. Very nice. They can't do anything attack wise really that I can't deal with in some way or other. Although they might have a they might have a combat trick in their hand. I really hope the audio is working fine. If it's not, I'm going to have to look into it. Okay, oh, that's plenty of lands. They've got no mana open. Um. So they've got no, they've got no mana open. That's going to redistribute its counters, I guess. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Right. No! Oh! Oh! See, there's a thing! Ah! I did the thing again! Sequencing! I, I, I saw that... I saw that also did it. Oh, I... Because... And once again, it was to end of turn. I guess was it? To, is it to end of turn? No, it's not to end of turn. Okay. Because I could have brought those out and then proliferated twice. But see, like. My mind. Right, if I attack with everything, I'm going to be open for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 damage. So let's attack in the air with 2. 
they'll both get through and then I'll proliferate with the rest of my stuff. See, last turn I didn't even consider that that's got vigilance. See? It's things like that. Plenty of stuff. Could have got another one one counter on those. See, another thing as well is that I've not... These are just cards from the princess that I don't know about. Not all of them, of course. Look at the little tenacious pup. Yet the main purpose of me recording this today is to check the audio. So did they get two one one counters? Is that right? Have I understood? Uh I've, yes. Can I... Well, they should have two each, shouldn't they? Now, can I just win with this? I think I can. So, you've got no mana open. No mana open. I mean, I don't think they've got any zero mana cards. Everything. Go on. Okay. Mysterious limousine. Not being the starting place is going to help me with that. That's a good card. Trample Toxic One. And it proliferates as well. I'm going to cast on turn one, so I'll bring you out. I'll bring you out turn two. Now you're a first striker 2-2. Two -two, so... I will bring you out and then after defend after not block next turn, but But I can use this Sylvan Smite to I mean that thing is gonna keep keep doing its thing I guess. Oh Right. 
right. Now I could bring this out first and then these things would start buffing it up. So I will be a bit behind. Give it protection from green. Red and green. Yeah. Oh dear. I think this is... I think they're going to kill me. I think they're going to kill me before I get the chance to do anything. Unless... I'm really unsure about this. I'm really unsure about which. Right. Protection from white and blue. Not gonna happen. You sorcery. Yeah, that was bound to happen. So they can attack with that. There's nothing I can do about it. So they can win in a few turns. When a creature does come down to a player, exile type two cards of your library, you may play cards just as we turn, you play an additional land this turn. Yeah, I mean that's ideal against this deck. I'm just being completely overrun here. It's got protection from green, doesn't it? Protection from red and protection from green. So this isn't going to... Alright. Okay. Whatever. Midweek madness. Midweek mad. It's always been called midweek magic. I've always called it midweek madness. Either way, it's. You're allowed to... I suppose you're allowed to be a bit sloppy. Because like I said, losing doesn't matter. I go first, so that's if, that gives me benefit for being first, doesn't it? If you weren't... No, it isn't. It's the opposite. But I can bring you up first. And then you up second. That'll power you up. And then... You up third if I get another land. Potentially. I mean, I'm going to hurt myself to play the Ledger Shredder.
What are you doing? Okay, well, I'm going to have to hurt myself anyway. Oh, that's good. Like, next spell you cast has a vigilance and a, tra a one, one counter, a vigilance trap. A vigorous and trample counter on. So that's got vigilance and trample now. Okay. So that's annoying. get that again. That's so good. Is it just me or is that so good? I don't see why they wouldn't attack with it. I mean, I could block, I don't think I had any mana open or anything. Uh, do I want to use that now? Or should I? Leave it. Right. I, I do not need a third one of them. through okay I'll see what I got next turn in my hand because I could bring that out and then the proliferate will have a really good effect. I mean, they could double block. I don't know why they don't attack with their ledger shredder. It's got vigilance. I mean, I, I mean, yeah, I suppose I could have a card in my hand. Um. Let's have you for blue. Yes. So 
So that the next creature, your next creature spell. So I think what I'll do next time is I'll use that to get rid of their ledger shredder. And then I'll... And then they're going to really want to stop me from proliferating in that case. See, that's got vigilance as well. Aha. There they go. Got no cards in their hand. I don't think there's anything they can do here to power anything up. Am I right? Uh, no mana open. I'm right there. Got nothing. So. That would give them a forest. Right. Yeah, I've got to remember that if I wasn't the starting player, which I wasn't. So that's how that works. But I don't get a 1-1 one -one counter on it. Is that right? Is there a 1-1 one -one counter? Put a 1-1 one -one counter attack which you control if you weren't the starting player. I don't think I was. Right, and I'll tell you what. I'll get three. Oh, no. Okay. Now I can attack with you and you. And they can't block off all the damage, so that's going to do. That's going to do one point damage, and they're going to proliferate and get a bunch of counters. Very nice. I keep looking at my lands thinking, well, how have I only got three lands? And then I remember, like, oh yeah, because a bunch of them are creatures. How many of them are creatures? Three of them, isn't it? Yeah, there's no point of them not attacking. Uh, I'll let... I'll let it through. Ah. Ah. Right.
so. If they want to block my 6-6, six, six, my, my big thing that's going to proliferate, they're going to have to block it with two things. Which they are going to do. Uh, how much proliferation is bad for me? Not too bad. Uh, I could give it to that thing. Um. Ah. Uh, no, I will get rid of you. That's okay. That leaves me plenty. Leaves me plenty of space open to do that. Two damage. That I need to do. I can still get in for all the damage I need to. They've got no mana open, they've got no death touch. These can't do anything. Oh, they're going to give themselves a couple of tapped forests. I can just attack with everything. Nothing they can do. Right. Okay. I think that was good. See, when I'm not doing like when I'm not doing draft, when I'm doing something like this, I tend to win like. I feel like I win 50% or over 50% of the time. I actually need one more win for this. If, I, if I've got to end this before then, then so be it. But I've got to get one more win. Just going to... Make sure that my headset is all plugged in and and everything's fine there. It seems so. Opponent goes first, right? Um, I could really build up to something with this. I think I could have it untapped. Ah, if you weren't the starting player, you may untap it. Also, I must have been the first... Right, okay, so I was the starting player last time. Uh, I'll scry one. Uh, no. I've got plenty to be working with here and not enough lands. Right. Oh... Use right, okay. Try to think of the order there. I think I'll get you out first. Right, well, they're not going to be playing that this turn.
Okay. If you weren't the starting player... Now, hold on, let's have a look. Where's this land here? Uh, if you weren't the starting... Right, okay, so I wasn't the starting player. That's good to know. So, I can get this to work. Endure an instant. Right. Ah, so they can play that next turn, potentially. Because it's to the end of your next turn. But they're not. Right, now, before the... This is what I was waiting for. Before the prowess kicks off. Put a 1-1 one, one on you. Because I'm not the starting player. Do 2 damage to you. Good. Right. I want to bring you out so I can give you the, the counters. And then I can keep proliferating. But with that, unless they can burn it somehow. But it's on such high toughness that I don't think that's going to be very easy for them, especially in mono red. Um, okay. So I could put that on itself, and then... Right, hold on. Before I do anything. Yeah, and they'll get a bunch of cards to be able to use. I'll do that them on yourself because that way I can get more through proliferate okay and because they've been mono red they're gonna have to do like a big burn thing to get through that seven and that's gonna be harder and harder it's gonna get harder and harder to block it as well So if they blocked with all three of those, that'd still only do six. First strike when it deals combat damage to a player, examine an online card from your uh, library at random. <sighs> so much text. Okay. Now. It's got vigilance, so that's okay. I can do. Let's start with both of those, actually. actually. Should I do all three? Yeah. They can't... I mean, they can kill that thing by blocking it with two things. Uh, yeah, I think that's fine. And then boom, boom. Proliferate. Now I can bring that out. Do I want to do that this turn? I could. But. Hmm. But I think. Yeah, I think I've won. Oh, well, I can do. One, two, three, four, one, two. I could do either. Let's just. Oh, I, yeah, I can do both.
yeah, still not enough. Okay, so, so okay, so see, when I did this event here, I got um three one. Because I only lost one game. But the, like I said, the most the, the main purpose of this. Uh, of doing this is just to make sure that the recording works. So I'm going to check that. Please say it does. Please say the audio is fine. Otherwise, I'm going to have to really look into it. <gasps> so thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time.